all right everybody welcome back to supreme tech today i'm going to show you exactly how to use the trello app it's a planning app it's also if you guys check out i'll put it in the cue cards now my video about using trello on a desktop computer or a laptop this is just going to be the mobile app version of that so you go ahead check that one out if you're using it on computer but today i'm just going to show you the mobile version and let's get right into it If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to the channel, turn on them post notifications, smash that like button, it really helps us out. Let's get right into this Trello app tutorial. So first thing, if you don't know what Trello is, it's a planning app. You can use it for anything you want to do. You can use it for your normal life. You can use it for content planning, for your YouTube channel, for Instagram, anything you need. What I use it for is all of the above right i use it for everything i use it for planning out from my grocery list to planning out my videos on my youtube channel so if you open up the app after you downloaded it make an account with the email and everything and this is going to be the home page right here at the bottom you can see they got boards home search notifications and account now the main thing with trello is boards so each board, let's just go into my Supreme Tech board here. Each board is going to have lists. And each list is going to have cards, right? So as you can see, I got these are all video ideas. Okay. As you can see, each list, see this one is for Windows, Mac, and computers. And then you go down here, these each are cards. So each board has lists. And each list has cards, right? So I got my to-do right here. I got the content queue, which is like my next video I'm going to make. And then I got video ideas for all these different subjects, right? So let's just take... Let's just do this here. Let's see. Shot cut, right? So say I click on shortcut inside each card you can add your you know you got your name of the list then you can add a description if you want then you can do all types of other stuff to it what I like to do is add a checklist say I'm making a video on shortcut I'll put my checklist of what I got to cover in the video Let's just do importing files. Right? There's one. Let's do detaching audio. That's another one. And then we can do intro, outro. And just so on and so forth. You just make whatever checklist you want to make, right? And then when you're done with a certain one, you just check it off. Say we got those ones done. They're checked off. See, and then it, on the bottom it says your activity, what you've done. So, see, I've completed importing files. I've completed detaching audio. And there's so much else you can do. You can add a due date. You can add labels. You can add different members. So say say you got your YouTube channel and you got other people that work on it. You can give permission to certain people, but they got to have a Trello account, obviously. And you can add different members into this group. And once you have them in your group, they can work. They can edit this is however they like. They can um, move stuff around. So it's just like a very handy app for having teams of people working on stuff also a big thing you can add attachments you can add pictures you can add videos you can add png files you can scan documents so anything you're going to use in your video you can add it here and everything is just neatly organized in this card 
and then you can go forth and do it you know for every single video idea right so say you're doing a uh, best picture video editing websites right click on it you can go add your um, checklist add your members if you need to um add your pictures whatever pictures you're going to use in there you can add your video files you can add your voice recordings whatever you're going to use and it's all there in that single card that's why i love this app so much because it's simple but it's got everything you need right so moving on we're going to go to the options here if you pull up the options um this is just you can look through it yourself it's just like the settings you got your settings here um, you can change different stuff in there you can close the board which is like deleting it um, you can share it all types of other stuff and then they got power-ups which is like adding different things to it they also got some stuff that you can add which is in the paid version but you do not need the paid version whatsoever to have a great Trello account right also here's where you can invite people this is where you can invite a team or you can go to your contacts and invite certain people in your contacts now like i said this is just my supreme tech board right so i also got boards for business personal and supreme tech i'm also going to make another board now to show you just click the plus button up here create a board and I'm going to put the fort because that's my other YouTube channel, right? That's my gaming channel. So we got this, the fort gaming. You can make the black uh, background a different color or you can choose different photos. They got a bunch of them in here. So, and you can search the photos. Let's just put video games. right and then you can use any of these as your background so let's just pick one let's just pick this one here right okay so now go back and this is my new fort gaming board okay we can add a list we can put video ideas add we can add another list scroll over let's do a to-do list add and then within your list you can just go to add card well what's a good subject to make a video game idea let's put how to download fortnite on ps4 Okay, click done. Let's add another one. Let's click uh, how to record gameplay. On Xbox, right? And you just keep going down the list. And this is a great way so you don't forget your video ideas. You don't forget anything. Also, if you want to move a card, you can move a, a specific card. You just hold it, hold down on it. You can move it to a different list, right? So you can move them anywhere you want. That's why this app is so great. It's so easy to work. It's so It handles great. It's so um, quick and easy, guys. So make sure to comment down below. Let me know if this video helps you out. Let me know if you're actually using Trello, if you're using the website version, or you're using the app version. Just shoot it in the comments down below. And also, be sure to check out, I got um, some links down in the description below about some great starter um, equipment for if you're starting a YouTube channel or if you're starting an online business. I got some links for some great equipment down there. Very good prices. I only recommend stuff that I've personally used. So go ahead, check it out. And thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.